Hello and a very good evening to you. Thank you to the lovely Adam. We have the launch of the one day special with Crafty Devils and it is a fantastic bumper bumper um, collection of 80 elements and here to help us with the brand new adhesive and explain all the different wonderful glues is the lovely Mel. Hello my darling. Hello, how are you? I'm very well. I'm saying we haven't, I've seen you since November. I know, it seems such a long time Honestly, ago. Honestly, lifetime ago. Have you been in since like then? Or? Yes, yeah, lots. Yeah. <laughs> just obviously just avoiding me and I don't blame you darling. Uh, now listen, tell me about this collection because it is rather spectacular isn't it? It's huge. It's huge, <laughs> it's, it's huge. huge. <laughs> right. So we We've um, got some really good driftwood plaques, driftwood tags, driftwood hearts, <laughs> everything you can think of, we've done in driftwood. <laughs> Absolutely everything. It's, it's super. It's amazing. I'll take you through it's everything amazing. and then Mel can it, because yes. I'm leaving it up to you to explain glue things to me. Okay, okay. Because uh, there's, a, there's a, lots of variants of some fantastic glue on the show. So let's start with our large, and because there's such beautiful samples behind me as well, we must show you these. This is the large A3 board. You're getting one of those. You're getting three of the A4, and they've all kind of got this driftwood feel. Three of the half A4 here. So this means, you know, if you want to create those kind of drop banner ones as well. Three of the A5. Sorry, I'm dodging about everywhere here, Hannah. This is three of the A5 here. There we go. That's all right. Ten of the driftwood plaques. So that would be, which one would that be? These? Yeah. Ten of those. Um, Fifteen of the tags. That's tag size there. Twelve of the paper roses. These beautiful paper roses here. Can we colour those, Mel? You can. You we can, can colour those. Um, colour them with your inks, paints, and you can use your structure paste on them as well. Fabulous. We get the whole alphabet. Notice I've put my own initials there at the front. Uh, the whole, and I love these because, as Mel has explained, they are already painted. But don't you worry if you don't like it. You can go over it with your mediums, or not. Obviously, not that letter necessarily. But with T, you know, you can just use the reverse and colour yeah. how you want with some of them anyway. Yeah. I like the fact that they're coloured because they're, they're gorgeous. So we're getting the whole alphabet there, plus some um, ands and what have you in there. Da -da. Now, you're getting some adhesives. Now, this is the 120 mil MDF glue. So that is for your MDF, isn't it? Then? Yes, so this is brand new for you today. Um, so we've gone larger with our MDF glue. Fabulous. Big and bold. <laughs> and a nice precision <laughs> nozzle there as well. We like that. They, they're really good nozzles. They're really good bottles. They're very um, squeezy. I'm the just bottles. Like squidgy. They're, not, they're yes. not hard to squeeze. Yes. Um, so I found... When, we've, um, when we developed our glues, I wanted something easy to squeeze cause, because I found with some glues, they're really hard. Yes, and you can't you get the end of it out. And you don't want I to yeah. use both hands to squeeze. No. You want to use one it's, hand. As long uh, as you can never get it out. No. It just means they're at the bottom. You're just like wasting a great <laughs> dump yeah. of it at the bottom. Or yeah. the 20 mil at the bottom. <laughs> yes. <laughs> then we're getting 60 mil of the deluxe glue. So this dries clear. Is this the secret this, here? This um, dries clear. It's um, a really quick fix as well. So really good for your papers. Um, and also it... It can keep its form, so you could double up and use it as a glossy accent. Ooh, I didn't know that. Yeah. And then I've got my tacky glue, 60 millimetre tacky glue. Yeah, so everybody knows what a tacky yes. glue is. That's, your, that's like your multi-purpose. Gives us a bit of wiggle room. Yes. There. And then this stuff is amazing. Mel was talking me through the different things with the gilding flakes and... Yes, you that's your crackle medium. Oh, that's your crackle medium. That's your crackle Sorry, medium. we were talking about something else, weren't yes. we? We'll, talk, we'll come to that. I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm getting <laughs> excited. And that is a big pot of our crackle medium. Um, and so, and, and, oh, just, I mean, just look at these. They, they, these are gorgeous. Some of these samples. I mean, there's so many, but the, you know, the little key rings as well. How many of the hearts are we getting? We didn't mention the hearts, did we? Um, I They're think part you get, of the plaques. Oh, I yeah, see. Yeah, part of the plaques. So I think you get um, two of each plaque. Ah, because there's different sizes, isn't there? The sort of square ones. Those are the tags. They're the so tags. So really good for um, party bags. Um, really good for um, little um, key rings. Uh -huh. They're, they're, they're just brilliant. Oh, they gorgeous. Love this with the musical notes on there. I think that's genius. Make really good little gifts as well. Yes. Um, and if you're having, um, now that we can, um, if you're having a little kiddie 
garden party or anything. <laughs> They're great for kids and they can make something and take it away with them. To the garden. To the garden. One of my favourites is right behind me. I'm sorry, I'm all over the place here today, Anne. It's just with, with um, Crafty Devil's chalk paint. Uh, create your own... Yes, memory board. What, what have I got to do? We love, you love your, your vegetable patch. I do. Don't I you? really you love, love the vegetable, the vegetable patch. patch. Look at this. That was done by one of my design <laughs> team and I just think that's so cute. Isn't it gorgeous? We've got hearts. We've, I, I love this one up here as well with the turtles. Sorry, Hannah. I, I'm really taxing you today, aren't I? Look at this. Isn't this beautiful up here? So that's the way we said about layering up your half A4 plaques, isn't yeah, it? If you want yeah. to create those signs. And um, we've got a really nice one um, behind me, the Peaky Blinders one. Oh, yes. Um, which is really good because that's used your um, gift tags and everything that's on it. It's layering them up, isn't layering it? Layering them up. And it just it looks brilliant with the crackle glaze. So they're that's not a bit just... Of decoupage there, a bit of decoupage there. They're not just individual use. You can um, multi-layer them. So they're, they're Gorgeous. just great for everything. So those plaques, I forgot to say that, you know, there's 20-pound savings. You've got the ovals, you've got the hearts. Um, just, just amazing collection. 20-pound saving, £35.88, 827562. And I've been told it's a time-limited offer, Mel. I'm it not is, looking at you, yeah. it's your company. <laughs> so of course it is. <laughs> there's over, there's, there's like 80 elements 80 to that elements. bundle. There we go. Loads on the website uh, that we're dying to tell you about. So please shop by brand. You've got your storage pots, oval hearts. We've got the magnet clasps as well. I know you love those. Brush set. Oh, Leone needs that. Uh, hexagon coasters. We've got tape. Crafty Devils, an incredible brand you can trust. Um, and because and, Mel and Mark, they develop themselves all of these, these, these mediums and what have you because they work with them and know what you crafters need. So it, it's good, superb quality and value for money money through and through oh black gesso white gesso can't beat that can't beat that um the snow glossy effects there blackboard paint don't miss out on that honestly just what you can go over it twice if you want to but one application is super duper that is brilliant stuff there if you want to do some of those chalkboards there 12.99 now i've got an amazing adhesive bundle and you've thrown in a little sort of bonus gift here as well haven't you so now? it's a little freebie that um our george um back at work um, played with yes and um, I just thought why hasn't anybody else thought of this <laughs> so it looks really odd there but it's um, you could make a cube so I've made one um, because I use it all the time so it's a little cube and it's just for standing your glue pot in upside down there we go. So when we were talking about so you haven't got to, to lean end. it up against <laughs> yes. anything or balance it on anything, and you can use it whatever way. You haven't got to worry about um, where where it lands because every side's got a hole in. Um, but I just thought, do you know what? Why hasn't anybody thought of that before? Absolutely. And our George did. So yes. so I thought. We'll give that away with the little glue bundle. Absolutely, and it's a great tester bundle as well because you're getting everything that you get in the one day special, but you're also getting our glitter glue now and your gilding glue. Now tell me, what's what's so great about our glitter and our gilding glue? So the, labels. the um, little blue label there, yep. that's our gilding and glitter glue. Yeah. So you put that on, wait 15 minutes. Um, you can put that onto your card, your MDF, um, anything like that. You wait 15 minutes, then you add your gilding flakes or your glitter. Yeah. Um, and it's done. Done. The pink one yeah. there is for your non-porous surfaces, mm. so like your glass. Yes. And it goes Plastics. on pink. Yeah. And you wait for it to dry, yeah. clear. I say dry, clear because it doesn't actually dry. It goes really, really tacky. Ooh. Now that will stay tacky for 48 hours. Fab. So it's something that you can pre-do the night before. Great. Um, but looks really good on wine glasses, Ooh. ceramics, Ooh. anything like that you can use that on. Fab. Uh, so this is a great bundle because then you've got your deluxe in there, you've got your MDF, you've got your tacky, which we use over and over again. Yeah. And our beautiful, I've already said you need to invent one of these for my sauce bottles. So I'm always forever turning my sauce upside down, trying to get that last bit out. Um, so that is the little bonus there. 10% already gone to a very, very busy as well for this and our one day special 1299 268009. And I promise you, Mel and Mark know their glue. They know <laughs> their glue. Um, now I've got a lovely bundle of gorgeousness look at all these fabulous letters so if you want more 
We've got 135 pieces here of all of the alphabet, plus those little and signs on there. Um, and like we said, you know, for certain letters, you, you can cover this with your your uh, mediums anyway if you don't want the coloured. You can, so you but can you use your you structure just... paste on them, yeah. you can crackle them, you can turn them over and have them plain, um, you can use your gilding flakes on them, mm -hmm. Ev everything, anything that um, you can use your adhesives on, you can cover them with. I love them, I love the fact that they're coloured, I think that's part of the appeal. <laughs> uh, that is, and they're, they're a lovely quality and they've been cut absolutely beautifully so if you're using them for your driftwood plaques especially for signs like dad's workshop or garden party this way or bentley's bentley sleeps here this is bentley's <laughs> pad um you know you've got those extra letters there which is which is absolutely fabulous 995 341 427 but as we said shop by brand crafty devils there's so much we've got on the show and so many bargains we'll try and get in as much as we can over the next 24 hours won't we mel so what are we starting with my darling so i'm going to do um a uh, little driftwood heart for for everybody Gorgeous. so we're going to start off with our driftwood heart and um, we're going to gesso so we're going to use your white gesso okay now it's really important to use gesso on MDF okay and um, I don't know what I've done with my white gesso so I've got my black pot here um, so you get your gesso and it comes with a click clack lid Yep. So it's a really nice lid and you can hold it upside down and nothing's going to come out until you squeeze it. Okay, it's a really good consistency. It's a big old pot, isn't it's it? It's a big old 500 pot. 500 mil. Yeah. I mean, 9 99 I love it because it's not a screw top, so quite yeah. often you just want to flick it with one hand. Yeah. Because um, you're, you're busy with your, with your other whatever, one. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to put your gesso on and then it's going to dry and your heart's going to look like that. Okay, and then what that means is that you're going to use less of your expensive products. So your paints that you pay quite a lot of money for, you're only going to need one, maybe two coats if it's a really pale colour. Um, whereas if you don't gesso, your first layer will soak straight into your MDF and you've kind of wasted that layer. Yes, it's a bit like when you've had your wall plastered. Yes. Just yeah, go in so with some old paint or whatever. Yeah, you usually know, do, go do your base layer. Do a base then... layer of white, don't yes, you? Yes, that's right. So it just means that you can paint straight on top of it. I'm, I'm going to do a pink heart. I don't know why I chose pink, but... Oh, we like it. It matches the pink heart that we were looking at earlier with the lovely stencil over it. Samples just... are fantastic. Yeah, um, I have to say a big thank you to the design team because they did Beautiful. a really good job. It's not all me. I don't. <laughs> you can't take all the credit. No, I can't take all the credit. The design team are, are really helpful. And they've, they've said they've really enjoyed doing it. Just something a bit different. Yeah, yeah I mean, just look at the heart there now with, those, the, with the edging. Uh, you know, it's almost like, like you said, that's hence the driftwood feel. Yeah. It's just a little bit, it's just different because we see hearts a lot, don't we? No, no disrespect, but we do. Yeah. And it just takes it to a different, it gives it a different edge. And I think as well with these hearts, you could make them Halloween-y. Oh, yes. Yeah, you could. So, multi-purpose hearts. Yes, you could indeed. Okay, so once you've painted, you're going to let your paint dry. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, I'm not because we haven't got time. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're going to put your crackle medium on. Now, your crackle medium is a one crackle product. You don't need anything to make this crackle don't work. need a second pot to layer over no, no. so your um, rule of thumb with your crackle is um, pcp so paint crackle paint and now i've had a lot of ladies oh. um email me and say oh, i can't get my crackle to work right and it's because they were putting it straight onto their gesso right you do need to paint first first paint crackle paint okay CPP. so yeah. definitely um put a layer of paint on there it's really nice consistency nice and gooey does does your paint have to be wet or dry or no? it should be dry right okay darling. but i just want to show you um so you can put as much on as you like and depending on how much you put on and how little you put on will depend on the type of crackle that you get so if you want a really fine crackle like um, a really fine 
bark on a tree you would paint yeah. it on quite thinly right or like or like on a photo when you want to age it or something. yes yeah but if you want a nice wide big crackle like a big oak tree kind of thing you would paint it on quite thickly is that what you've done on bentley's or the craft room uh, side? yes they... so i've yeah. done a bit of both mm. on there so you just paint that on And we get the uh, fantastic crackle medium in your one day special as well. Big, big tub of it as well. There. It's such a good tub. I've been yeah, using the crackle on mil. the shows um, probably since I think we launched it in January. Mm. And I've done quite a few shows with it and used it quite a lot on samples. And this is only my second pot. Wow. So it does go a long way. So again, paint it however you want to go but I always do a bit of thin a bit of thick just to give it um, a different kind of uh, texture all over mm -hmm. okay and then you need to set that to one side to air dry you can't force dry it um, so you can't use your heat gun on it or anything like that you have to let it dry by itself and how long, sorry, Melvin? Um, so I usually leave mine for about half an hour and yeah. then it's kind of like tacky. Yeah. Um, and then you can paint onto it. Um, and I always use a different colour. So my base colour is usually slightly darker mm -hmm. than my top colour. Right. Okay, so you put that to one side to let it dry. Here's one I did earlier. And I'm going to paint a paler colour so it's always good to use two different colours because otherwise you're going to crackle and it's going to look the same you, when the crackle will stand out as well yeah. yeah okay so we're going to paint this on top and you will see almost immediately it will start to crackle You can see it starting up here. Mm, I can see it, yeah, we can see it start to, starting to get, and that suits the sort of the driftwood feel as well in, in their one day special. It does, it's like, because driftwood does dry out and split and crack, doesn't it? And you find it on the beaches. Mm, and it's part of the charm, isn't it? Yeah. And I just, this is so mesmerising to watch <laughs> because it just develops. You just keep seeing different parts crackle. Yeah. So I can I can wa I could watch that until it dries, <laughs> just just because I'm just so fascinated by it. And you'll see, like I've painted on thin areas, thick areas. Yeah. I've dabbed the paint somewhere, so it looks kind of rustic. Gorgeous. Which is a look I quite like. Okay. Yep. And then we're going to use some papers to stick on. I like to tear my paper. Very busy for the one day special, 20% already gone, just highlight that, and the 80 elements. So forgive me Mel, so we're getting the little, because I didn't have these on there, but we're getting the little keyring ones as well, are we, the smaller ones? Yes, they're the, they're, they should be there somewhere, are they not? They just look smaller though. Yeah, no, there's definitely some about somewhere. Oh, I think it's, is it the next one down? What have I been, am I being dozy? Because I'm, I'm thinking I want everybody to know <laughs> that you're getting 80, uh, 80 yeah, elements Yeah, you're getting so 80 elements there. So we get so the, the tags, but we're also getting the keyring tags as well. So yes. how many of those are we getting? <laughs> 15 in total of the tag tags, so the smaller and the medium. Five of each size. Yeah, sounds like it, yeah. Five of each size, so five of this size, five of that size, and there's another size, is there another, oh there we go, five of, the, five of the, that size as well. Sorry everybody, I just want to... I just wanted to clarify. There we go. There's your medium ones. There's the smaller ones, and then there's there's the larger ones. So sorry, I didn't want it because because the, the little ones weren't there on the on there, and I wanted everybody to know that they are getting three sizes, five each of those tags there, um, of, of of the tag size there, um, and then you're getting those hearts. Let me show you this different this sort of squarey kind of one, but then you've got. Um, ovals of the plaques as well and then that's a three different you see the three of each of, the, of these as well of the plaques um great for father's day yeah. coming up oh. like make dad a key ring 
gorgeous. Well, I'm just looking at this. This is fabulous. I'm sorry to reach behind you there, Mel. Yes, that's I am brilliant. keeping me two meters. Yeah. She's, she's way in front of me. I am. Um, <laughs> but isn't that gorgeous? That's great. That's done by one of our lovely design team. I can't take credit for that. That's the big A3 one you get in there as well. But I mean, if we look at the one above it there, dreams that will always follow you. This one above is just beautiful. Now that's using the crackle medium Mel's just referring to. And isn't that gorgeous? Because you get uh, three of those, the, the A4 size. And we will come to it because I'm besotted with the craft room one uh, down here. And honestly, it's just, just amazing. Oh, you like um, that one, don't I you? I do, I am a bit. Just because so you were trying sparkly. to explain to me what's going on in that one, Mel. Yeah, so she's done um, a white background with a dark... Um, no, a dark background with a white, well, whitey, silvery top. Amazing, isn't it? It looks like I it's think. lighting up. Or is it the other way around? Let me have a look. Yeah, so it's a dark, and then she's washed a white over it, but I think she's mixed a brown in, and then she's used glitter glue around the edge. It just looked like light. I thought it was lit up. Yeah, it's great effect. Oh, it's amazing. Amazing, just how different all the plaques uh, can look. So it's working out... At, you're saving 45 pence per oh it's working out as 45 pence per element so for this this large md at 45 pence this large 250 crackle pot 45 pence you've got your three glues there anyway um 45 pence amazing amazing stash builder i had a lovely email from mo uh, she said she knew she shouldn't have tuned in tonight, Mel. Yeah. She wasn't supposed to buy anything this month, but she's had to come. Mo, you have to give in to it. You know, you need this in your life, Mo. It's too Don't good a bargain. Resist. It's too good a bargain. It is too good a bargain, that, isn't it? It's just too good. I've got to tidy up my mess here now. I've not But so plaques. many gift ideas, so many yeah. presents, um, and especially now that we're kind of getting back to normal, um, just great for your craft stalls. Yeah. And because I think this summer everyone will still be in their gardens when it's not pouring with rain, and people are decorating their gardens. Yes, you've so got space great more. for that. Your shed, yes. your, your, your den, your whatever it is, your work tools, your little gazebos, whatever. or your yeah, um, the dog's kennel or something. Or... Yeah, <laughs> the <So>. fairy garden <laughs> behind the trees, you know, for the little one. <laughs> so I'm using our del deluxe glue, and I just want to show you how easy this is to squeeze because. I'm just going to light squeeze and it just flows out. I just, I love these bottles. They're so easy. And the deluxe glue, glue you get a good grip straight away. So I'm just sticking my paper on there and that will grip nice and easily. You've got to think about where you want. So it just comes out beautifully. Mm. It's got a nice um, flow to the bottle. Can't decide if I want to put that piece on yet. So I'm just gonna, and then I'm going to get my structure paste. And when I'm doing little bits with my structure paste, I like to use a paintbrush yeah. to um, put it on. So I just want to, I just want to finish off the edges with my structure. We'll get that up on the screen there. We've got Crafty Devils textured structure paste. Again, a big pot like your crackle, uh, your crackle medium there. 250 mil, uh, 9.99. Great price points here with Crafty Devils, 192726. I should have mentioned as well, your fantastic glue. And there is a brand I won't buy for that exact reason that you just said about, you know, the squeezy bottles. Yeah. And when it gets to the bottom, it drives you around the twist. And I think, why did they design it like this? Because I can't get to the end of my bottle. I can't get out the bit at the bottom and it drives me insane. And I won't buy it anymore. But these, you, we have got your big ones as well, 240 mils in your, uh, your tacky glue and your um, MDF glue and what have you. So do shop by brand on the web. We just, we, I like to think about these things when we're developing products. Yeah. Um, and it's all the things that I think, I've bought a product and I think, oh, they could improve that by doing yeah. this. They could, and I just thought, well, why don't we do it? Exactly. Like, why don't we, why don't we do it's it? It's definitely more user friendly. Yeah. So my structure paste, I'm just dabbing on with my paintbrush. I love this stuff. It's, um, it's got quite a nice gritty texture to it. Yeah. Holds its shape, so it's you can manoeuvre it about and then it will stay how you finish it off. Mm -hmm. 
And I just think it gives a, a little bit of finish to your edging of your papers there. And it, it's it's not a white structure paste. It's got it's got a bit of a creamy colour to it. Mm -hmm. um, but you can mix a colour with it oh. if you want to add colour. So you can mix um, like your acrylic paint. Um, okay. It will change the density slightly, but it should still keep all its form and everything. It will be fine. I'm just going to put my lid on my glue. Okay. What am I going to do now? Let me see. Some roses, I think. Oh, now we get 12 of those lovely roses in your one day special. And we were saying, weren't we, Mel, that you can colour these, you told us. You can colour them with your inks, your sprays, um, your structure. I, I'm going to put a bit more structure paste on them because I love the stuff. Um, and um, your pens. Ooh. Ev everything yeah. you can use on these. They are wired as well so you mm -hmm. do get a wire stem on them um, which is quite handy to hold on to while you're playing around with them or coloring or yeah, yeah and then and then i cut it off if i need to if you want more of the roses we've got 60 a pack of 60 of those paper roses there and i love the size of them um they're absolutely beautiful only 9.95 for another 60 of those 100491 and you can color and texture to your heart's content you're adding some texture paste there i am mm. i just i love this stuff <laughs> and it gives a little bit, um, because they are paper, if you are making a gift, it does just give that extra little bit of structure to the paper so it doesn't go squish flat. Okay, so I'm going to do three. And if they, obviously they're coming in the post, if they, because they are paper, they might go a bit flat. You can shape them yeah, yourself, just give, a little you know, just give them a little zhuzh when they get to you. I just, there's a thing about roses, isn't there? They're just such a nice flower. Yeah, absolutely. We were talking with um, the, uh, our, our lovely Nikki earlier in Hartfelt, you know, the wild roses and your regular roses. And so many different beautiful. ones and different yeah. colours. So you can add colour to them or you can keep them plain. I'm going for like an old fashioned -y look, so I'm going to keep them plain. I'm going to alter that one a little bit because he seems to have got a bit squished but you can bunch them up as well I'm just I just love all this stuff just sit for hours playing <laughs> I did have a big accident with my crackle glaze the other day though oh no what happened yeah so I was crafting and um one of the dogs jumped up at me <laughs> um, to try and get on my lap and my um, crackle glaze, the whole pot went oh. over my glass mat and my project. Oh. <laughs> so I was not a happy bunny. Oh, love. The dogs were in trouble. <laughs> yeah, and they literally were at the dog house. Yeah, they were, definitely. So I'm going to cut the backs off. Oh. So nice and easy. Just a normal pair of scissors will cut that for you. Yeah. Quarter of the stock of the one day special has gone now, just to highlight that for you. A quarter of the stock has gone very, very busy. And uh, do, do shop ahead for the web because we're, we're just scratching the surface of uh, the products that Crafty Devils can bring us tonight. Now, I think I might do a little stamp on there as well. Yeah. So I'm going to use one of my gypsy stamps which I love. Um, so they're available on the website as well, if you shop by brand. Um, ink pad. So this, I think this is one of the sayings. And what does it say? What have you got there? The best thing, best, thing to hold on to in life is you ah. oh it's a bit soppy isn't it but it's quite <laughs> sweet <laughs> it's quite sweet a bit soppy but sweet okay we don't mind sweet soppy don't ask it doesn't have to all be irony and cynicism no no 
So I'm just going to stamp that on there. Oh, my paint's a bit wet, so it's not come out great. But I'm going to cover that up a bit as well. So I want it to look old and shabby chic. Shabby chic. Shabby chic. So for my um, for these ones, I'm going to use a glue gun because uh, I want them to dry quickly. <laughs> I'm going to use a glue gun. <laughs> what's happened to my glue in there so just put your flowers where you want to mm -hmm. they have got a hangy hole on the heart um, but if you don't want oh, to yes. use the hangy yeah. hole you um, can just cover it up you've got that on quite I should mention actually you've got that on quite a few of your, your, your plaques actually um, you've got it on your smaller tags there for our key rings we've got it on like you said the hearts and the the larger the larger tags there and the the, the oval and um, you can see it on on the, the the half a4 ones as well so if you did want to do that uh trilogy of yeah name plaques or you know you make a little trilogy of um words or sayings or i like that little sentiments there as well so they're already pre-cut into there as well so that's that's a really good point actually in terms of being able to hang them and what have you so saves you the bother yes and um so you you can make them oh, make them um what do they call that like a waterfall hanging yes um yeah. to make a nice sign if you want to yeah um, just add your embellishments on to make it look a bit shabby cheeky i like buttons as well mm. we've all got button jar at least should have i've got a button jar my, I can remember my gran having a tin of buttons Button when tin. I was little oh. and I just used to like put my hand in it yeah. and just playing with the buttons. And the noise in the tin. Yeah, yeah, it's just quite therapeutic, isn't it? All the colours. So, and then what I've got some little embellishments to put on there. You could just get um, what we're going for here. So if you weren't if we weren't going for speed, uh, what one? Which one of your glues would you use, um, Mel? For these acu these are sort of accoutrements. My MDF glue. Yeah, MDF. Yeah, um, brilliant. We've got that in the in the one day special. Yeah, a big pot but of on um, on the show we haven't got time. No, for we're it, going for so speed, which is why we're yeah. using our glue gun. But you get a big one twenty mil pot of the MDF glue, and I know on the show on Crafty Devils as well by brand, you've got big um, two forty mils of the pots as well. I just think that that will make a really nice gift for somebody. So that just goes to show what you can do with our little hearts there. Beautiful. It's quite sweet, isn't it? Yeah, and then like you said, it's got the holes there whether you want to attach a ribbon or have it hanging or gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. and you've got two different shaped hearts there as well. Yes. So not just the one heart. Let's have a little look. So is it the which one is it? Is the you've got the elongated, haven't we? And the one that you were just showing us smell? No, that's the one the I was showing is the short fatty one. And that's, and the, that's elongated. the elongated yes. one, yeah. So really so nice that one. for putting your stencils and things on. So that there's that one and then let me just hold up. There we go. You're getting that shape as well. So of these plaques, because there's two each of those, you're getting that's two designs. You're getting five different designs. So we get that two of each of these, you see. Then that differs because that's, this is more squared. And then two of the ovals. So that is two, four, six, eight, ten of the plaques. You're getting three of the half A4, one of the A3, three of the actual A4, three of the A5. Now, remember, let's go back to the tags. <laughs> go slowly for me. Katie, 15 of the tags, three of each, five of each size. So this size, the little ones and the larger ones. Plus 12 of your paper flowers here that we can colour. Plus your alphabet. Uh, we know there's not 27 letters in the alphabet because you've also got the extra ands in there. So 27 elements there. But of course, you can cover them with your paste or use the underside for certain letters as well. But they are beautifully painted. Plus you're getting your adhesives. You're getting the big, big pot there of your crackle medium 250 pot. You're getting that gorgeous, gorgeous MDF glue there. Big pot there. And your tacky glue. 
and your deluxe glue as well. And they, they really are super squidgy because I was discussing the fact that I can't stand it when you get to the bottom and you can't squeeze anything out. Uh, all of this for £35.88. Now, whether you're huge £25 saving, look at that with the crackle medium. We were talking Halloween earlier with Mel. Little gift ideas, you know, they might be the, your little, yeah, save the day. Isn't that gorgeous? Just to keep it. Um, just, you know, these are the smaller plaques. There's so much going on here as well. There's your, your beautiful hearts, the two different shaped hearts, two of each you're getting there, the large ones as well that Mel was using us. The, 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 the plaques as well, you know, to the garden, Bentley's Den, little gift ideas, love from, or it could be if your your brand. I mean, they're just just beautiful. And then so many, so many gorgeous samples behind me. I, I don't know if Hannah can see any of these. We were we were looking at this one with with the with the Crafty Devils blackboard paint there. Um, this is this is beautiful. Look at this one on the A4. Isn't that gorgeous? The design team isn't that beautiful. Um, you can name your house if your house has all the cottage garden. So many different. Uh, you've got one here. I don't know if you can see this one, Han. Uh, our treasure map. Look at this children's treasure. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, sorry, if I get out of the way, that helps. Uh, as we move across there, we've got a seashell theme. Did you see the baby penguins that were born at the zoo this morning? Oh, it's so cute. Um, and then again, look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? Your mixed media, the large A3. Ah, oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. And over a quarter of the stock has gone. So please don't miss out. Now, uh, that's everything you're getting there. You will, you'll be just lost for hours. We'll just lose you in the shed for hours in the crafty room. You'll have so much fun with all of that. Big saving, 20 pounds saving, working out 45 pence an element. Now, uh, well, adhesive bundle, yeah, very popular because crafty devils know their glue and their mediums. I promise you they do. They develop it themselves because they know what they're talking about. And you're getting the bonus of that little um, cube box to which this forms the cube and then you just Make sure you get every, every little uh, uh, ounce out of uh, those glue pots. And they're super squeezy with a fine nib application. Now, these are the two new ones here. This is your gilding and your glitter. Um, and that is for, as it says, wood paper and your card. So your gilding glue, lovely high tack. Then for things like your ceramics and your glass um, and your plastics, the non-porous surfaces. Um, so you can do this the night before Mel was saying you've got then So it, it's pink, but it dries clear. Um, and then we've got our MDF as well. We've got our deluxe and our fantastic tacky there as well. So super duper collection there, £12.99, plus that little bonus box there as well to store them. 268009. We've got different sizes as well. Look, there's the big one, you see? If you want to go for big ones, there, yeah, just to show you the different size. So we've got those big ones in a, a oh, that's the half size, that's 120. That's half the size. That's that's the that's mommy bear. Uh, Nine ninety seven for all three of those. Brilliant MDF deluxe and the tacky four eight one zero seven two. If you want your MDF glue bundle, you can go for all the sizes there. Yeah, two sixty and one of the two forty, which is the big pot I just showed you. Nine ninety seven. So three zero two zero eight zero. If you've got lots of projects to do, fantastic. Right, let's go back to Mel. What are you going to show us now, then, Mel? So I'm going to show you something a little bit different with our, one of our um, products, which is our masking sheets, um, which we have on um, the web there. Um, and I've die cut it to use it as a stencil. So I've run it through my die cutter and then I'm going to stencil it onto one of our lovely tags, which again, are on tonight's show and I'm just going to stick it on the tag like so and then I'm going to give you a sneak peek so you need to watch um, tomorrow's show for a sneak Ooh. peek. I'll just mention that tag bundle there we've got 25 there we go uh, so you get the hearts, the large, and the uh, the medium there. Eleven ninety nine, six four nine zero five four. Eighteen pounds saving there. It's super duper. I've just got a little bit stuck to my underneath. I didn't quite tap out properly. So there. So I just want to show you that the masking sheets are, are not just for stamping. You can make your own stencils with them. 
Brilliant. Yeah. Okay, it's a little sneaky peek of a product for tomorrow's show. Now, I haven't gessoed this, um, but you can gesso if you want um, a brighter colour um, for your inks. But I'm going for a bit of a grungy, grungy colour. So. But this is going to um, save your fortune on stencils mm -hmm. if you use the mask in papers. So when when's this going to be tom tom tomorrow, did you say, late? Um, so these little beauties, yeah, I believe are on tomorrow. Tomorrow, 8am or 12, do you know? You're just I'm teasing not, me now. I'm just teasing because I don't teasing. know what time. She doesn't know. <laughs> well, we'll have to watch both. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we'll have to watch both now, won't we? <laughs> it's, it's on a happy hour. Are very busy for the one day special so please don't forget to check out your baskets and uh, the glue but there's that lovely glue bundle i'm dying to see um the the gilding and glitter uh, in action you, will, will that be happening in the next 24 hours mel your new gilding and glitter glues uh, well, I, I might possible? use them they they've been on before they're are not they? new the oh, new to me. glues yeah. are the deluxe glue oh sorry my mistake sorry darling yeah and the tacky glue oh and the new size mdf Okay. Okay, so look at that. Brilliant. Make your own sense. Yeah. Fab. But that's gonna save your fortune, isn't, isn't it? it? Isn't it? On on buying the um plastic stencils because everyone's got the die cuts, haven't yes. they? Yes. So I just wanted to show you something different with the masking sheets, so they're not mm. only for stamping. Okay. I'm going to just put this back over here because this is for another show. <laughs> I did see that. <laughs> Your handy, handy little, handy little um, dorber stand there yes. for another show. She's not showing us that. I'm not showing you. <laughs> you want, uh, no, not showing you. You have to watch tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> You're a rutter. But it works with all our other storage. So, give you a little clue. So we've got about a quarter of an hour remaining. Right, now. so I'm just going to show you our blackboard paint as well. Crap. So our blackboard paint, I like to do um, two coats, yeah. one horizontal and one vertical, because that um, forms like a, 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 a mesh yeah. of the paint. Good ad ad adhesion, doesn't yes. it? Yes, yeah. and so that... Um, if you're rubbing, if, so if you've only painted it on one way mm -hmm. and then you've got a damp cloth or sponge mm -hmm. and you're wiping it off one way yeah. and you've only done one coat, you don't want to have the underneath product come through, do you? No, of course not, no. So if you do it um, both ways, it, it kind of forms a mesh, doesn't it? So you're not going to get that. Can you do a material, uh, Mel? Like a canvas? Does it work on like a canvas? I haven't tried that, but I don't see why not. Yeah. I think you might have to do maybe three layers. Yeah. Um, because the first layer will soak straight in, yeah. won't it? Yeah. Um, we'll have to try it out. We'll sometime. have to give it a go. Mm. But it's got a really nice gloopy consistency. Twelve ninety nine, big bottle. You know, I'm a big fan of your blackboard paint. There, zero one six four six zero. Five hundred mil bottle, mm. which is a good whopper. Good size. Now you don't have to gesso with this, you can paint straight onto your MDF with this yeah. or your wall um, in your kitchen or in a Ooh. child's playroom. Like a, if you kind of created like a little square, masked off a square or something. Yeah. Yeah, or on the door. Yes, back of the Bab. door. Oh yeah. But you can or see your, it gives your, a really good... Your drinks shed. You could have, you know, the, the cocktail of the day in chalk. Yes. I bet people have created drinks bars and all sorts. Oh, the big driftwood plaque you yeah. could have as a cocktail menu, cocktail menu for yeah. the garden. Gin cocktails, gin bar. Pim's o'clock. Pim's o'clock. You could change it every day, yeah. Beer o'clock. Oh, see, I love a Pim's. Oh, you know it's summer when the Pim's comes out. Yeah. Well, we usually go to um, Chelsea Flower Show. Oh, how um, lovely. But obviously it's not on this year. No. Um, or it's delayed. Um, so we're having our own Chelsea 
flower show in the garden. Fabulous. So we will be cracking open the pims on bank holiday weekend at about 10 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> so we all know where to go that morning. By lunchtime, we won't care what flowers are in the garden. No, you won't care if it's raining <laughs> or what the weather's doing, quite frankly, if it were to start at 10 o'clock. <laughs> so um, normally I would let my first layer dry, but obviously we're in the studio and um, it's not it's not as warm in here because the aircon's on. So we'll paint the other way. But there, I think these make really good um, key rings for like the shed key. Oh yeah. Because everybody always loses it. So you need something of a decent size, don't you? Yeah, because the shed key, I don't know why, but the shed key is always like massive, isn't it? Because everybody always loses it. Yeah. Yes. Or yeah. is it just like a different, like an old fashioned lock? Yeah, it's just like a big old... It's like a yeah, long, yeah, long key, yeah. isn't it? Whereas yeah. it's not a Yale key, is no. it? It's the other. I don't know what yeah. that key well, is it's called. It's like a chubby, but longer than a chubby, isn't it? Really? Yeah, it's, I don't even know what that key's called. No, because your chubs are about sort of finger size, and but then you there's a nice long length to it, like proper old jailer's key. Yes, <laughs> old jailer's <laughs> key. <laughs> <laughs> so you would let that dry, and that's that's it with our blackboard paint. Yeah. It's such a good consistency. You just mm. need two coats, vertical, horizontal, and you're done. Done. Um, but again, you can put that on your wall, the back of a door, um, paper. So you could put yeah. it on paper oh, yeah. and then put it onto a card onto a and card. write a message. Yeah, lovely. Um, your notice boards, kids' playroom. Yeah. Everything like that. But what I would say, um, is don't put it onto your um, mat. Um, I forget the name of these mats. I've got, I've got brain. No, the actual blending mat. Oh, the blending mat, yeah. Yeah, your... Um, I don't know, what is well, that mat called? I don't know. I've, I've got mat. brain fog. Yeah. Um, use um, your palette because it will stain. Oh, OK. So if you don't want your mat to stain, use, use your palette. OK. Um, but yeah, no, it's really, really good stuff. 12.99, 016, 460, okay. uh, £3 saving there, big pop, 500 mil. Gorgeous. We've also got our lovely stencil glue Ooh. on the show as one of our mediums. This is a game changer when it comes to stencils. You don't have to use your... Um, purple tape to hold your stencils down you haven't got to worry about it moving okay so you just um, squeeze a bit out onto your glass mat mm -hmm. it's washable as well so you can wash your stencils after squeeze it onto your mat this one's still a bit tacky from before mm -hmm. um, damp sponge I'm just going to use a little bit of water from there stick it onto your Dab it onto your stencil on one side. Dab it all over your stencil. Right. Let it dry for about 20 minutes. Oh, OK. Um, and then your stencil is going to go tacky. Uh-huh. And then it's Replacement. going to stick onto your card. Ah. So we don't get that, that tendency for sometimes if it shifts or that smudging underneath. Exactly. Especially if it's very decorative like that. Yeah. Exactly. Get two of those repositional stencil glues there. 82 mils in the bottle. 3315219.99. And then I've not seen that your... before. It's really good stuff. It's a yeah. total game changer. So will that? Um, so if I, when you peel it off, Mel, can I? Can I? Is it still tacky to put onto another? Sh another yes. Card yes. This until is I when wash I wash it. Until or... you wash it, warm yeah. soapy water. Right. So okay. this is one I did earlier because I needed to let it dry. So again, I'm going to use my can't look over here but I'm going to use my stencil brushes okay then I'm gonna it just makes life easier you could concentrate on like you're doing with the shading then can't yeah. you yeah and don't have to um you're, you're just touching it there to position but you yeah, don't have to just hold, hold it, it in, it in yeah. position yeah you don't want your paper moving around. No, everywhere. there's no chance of that, that, that. It's sort of slipping underneath, smudging. 
That's it. Uh, there we go. And I, I don't suppose there's any damage to the surface when you remove it. There's no... No, um, no, no. Substance left on the paper or no, anything? No, no. That's what I like about it. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to blend. So I'm just holding my... Um, in the middle here just to yeah, stop just my card from moving around yeah, yeah. not actually holding the stencil down it just makes blending a lot easier mm. especially with an intricate stencil like that there's so much opportunity there for it to shift isn't there yeah especially when you get the, when you get the whole thing covered um let's go for that one Fab. And um, 82 mils, so that's much, I mean, uh, if you think about our 60 bottles here, they're bigger than um, the, the 60 ones there. Um, yeah, fantastic. And two of those. So that, and you saw the tiny fraction that Mel used there, 331521. And of course, that stencil is still tacky then to put onto another card um, and remains tacky until you wash it in warm, soapy water. Fab. Know what your um, underneath is going to look like until you peel it off. No, so <laughs> this is just new for me. I'm just playing with this. Oh wow! Look at the quality. So Isn't that, that fantastic? One. And then one I did earlier, which is dry. So you just you've got no bleeding with that. It just sticks down. Amazing. And you just wash it in warm soapy water and it's ready for your next use. Gorgeous. Uh, but you can use it several times. Yes, yeah. Fantastic, because that's ready to go onto another card now. Now yes. you get two of these, just to show you the size, because there's our 60 in the one day special. You get two there of the 82 milliliter there, two of those pots. The 999 Fantastic. I'll have a quick recap of the one day special and go straight back to our Mel. 30% of the stock has gone. You're getting your A3, three of your A4, three of your half A4. Um, you're getting three of your A5. You're getting five of the small keyring size, five of the medium, five of the large plaques. Two of each designs, another 10 of the plaques. Elongated heart, I call it the squidgy heart. Um, sort of rounded edge, scalloped edges there, square rectangles there, two of those, and two of the ovals. That's 10 in total. 12 of your lovely paper roses there that you can colour with the stems. Full alphabet there with your extra and, so 27 there. And then your adhesive collection, which is your big pot of your 250 uh, mil crackle medium, the new uh, gorgeous tacky glue and the new deluxe glue. And then also the, the good staple there, 120 of the MDF glue there as well. All for an amazing £35.88, £20 saving, 827562. Right, Mel, four minutes. What can you rustle up for me, my darling? So I'm just going to show you these letters because they're such good value. Yeah. Um, so you get one pack um, in your uh, one-day special. Yeah. So you get the whole alphabet plus um, like yeah. your ands. Yeah. Um, but if in the other pack you get four packs, so you you have got four of each letter. Yeah, loads. Um, but such good value. Now, if you don't want them uh, rainbowy coloured, you can just put. You can paint them with your acrylic paint, but I just want to make them a bit rusticy looking um, mm. for my next project. So I'm just going to put some structure paste on there, move it about a bit, give it a bit of a wiggle. And that's going to dry rock hard. So it sounds like cement when you're using it and mm. it dries hard like cement. And how long does, sorry, forgive me to repeat myself, how long does that take to dry about Melbourne? Um, probably about 20 minutes, half an hour. Oh, quick then. Depending on how much you put on. Right, how much you've laid if you, on. Yeah, if you're putting it on really thick, it, it'll take longer. Okay, so once you've put it on, mm. it's going to go dry. Let it dry and it will look like so. Ta -da. Okay, and then hmm. you can paint it. Get a little paint brush. How are we doing on time? Three minutes, Mel, three, three minutes. minutes. 
But you'll be back with us at eight, won't you? Yes, I will, for another project. Gorgeous. So paint your letter with your... I'm just using an acrylic paint. And I don't want it everywhere. I want a little bit of um, white coming through. So I'm not going in all the nooks and crannies. I'm just painting it roughly. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'm going to use my glossy effects. So your glossy effects, um, you get two bottles of this as well, mm -hmm. um, 82 mils. And again, the bottle's really nice and easy to squeeze. Gorgeous. Nice and malleable. Yeah. So same size as our, 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 our lovely, um, what was the one we were just talking about? Yeah, 82 stencil mils. Stencil paste. Yeah, the stencil paste. And then I'm just going to put this on. So it goes on Ooh, a milky colour. Yeah. But dries clear. Ooh, I'm not seeing glossy effects on texture paste. Um, 998 for the two bottles there, 121675. Got 90 seconds, Mal. We're well, so back at eight, so anything that's not dry we can show with our Adam at eight. Ah, oh, it's so magic. Uh -huh. Look at that. There's one that's dry. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> that's like Alan Partridge, sorry. So uh -huh. it just gives, I don't know, do you want me to lift it? Yes, would you, Mel? Just yeah. To, but it just yeah. gives that nice little shine to it. Almost looks like enamel or glass, yeah. now, doesn't it? Yeah, for your next wow. project. Fantastic. Well, Mel will be back at 8 o'clock. There's the two bottles of your glossy accents there. £9.98, one, two, one, six, seven, five. Please don't miss out on your one-day special. As you can see, we're trying to introduce as many of the gorgeous um, extra elements that um, Crafty Devils can bring you because there's so much. So each hour, Mel will be trying to introduce everything that's there on the website because they really are wonderful at uh, developing these fantastic glues and textures and uh, pastes and what have you. So loads of savings to be had in the one-day special. Take advantage. We've got shoppers in New York and America, all over, all over the country and worldwide. So enjoy, enjoy. Don't forget to check out your baskets. Twenty pounds saving. And if you've got any questions for Mel, uh, then eight o'clock she will be with us, as this was just the launch of the one day special. So please don't miss out. Eight two seven five six two. Mel, thank you so much, my darling. Thank you. I had the pleasure of, of of being with you at the end tomorrow as well. I start and we finish oh, together, my darling. Brilliant. Yeah, she hasn't run away by then. <laughs> uh, we'll see Mel at eight. And uh, oh yeah. Yeah, lots more still to see tonight.